Hey YouTube, Jason here with Day Train Fearless. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. And as always, let's jump right into it. So today we're actually looking at Bookmap. Um, I've been using Bookmap for, I'd say about five years or so. I think it's one of the best um, platforms you can use um, that actually links up with your broker. Um, so you'll need contact your broker to see if they have it. Um, I use stage five for uh, trading my futures and it links up to where I could dr actually trade directly from bookmap into my stage five. So um, what it does is it pulls the data feed and stuff like that and I can actually place trades, right? So if I come over here to um, the control panel over here, right, I can actually turn on a dome and I can actually uh, do both where I have a dome and charts. I could buy and sell. I could set up bracket orders, do OCO orders, right, down here. Um, I could change my brackets to two uh, and four. If I want to go four and four, five, maybe eight and eight, right, risk uh, eight ticks to make eight ticks and all that. And actually trade directly off of the charts, right? Um, I could flatten the position, do all that, and they'll run actually directly directly through my think or, or sorry my uh, stage five who I day trade uh, my uh, futures with so um, it's a really um, just really helpful because I don't if I want I don't even have to open up my uh, stage five training platform to do it so um, that's one of the great benefits here um, also as you could see you um, I have the ESU uh, zero um, or USU 20, uh, 20 future contracts, which are the September contracts. And I also have the micros. So if, uh, if you're looking to trade the micros, you could pull up the micros too, which is really good. Um, and then over here, the way I have my personal layout is I have the uh, VWAP right here, okay, as you could see, which is amazing how well it works, okay. Come up, right, come down, bounce, bounce, fail, come up, re uh, reverse, 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 come up, reverse. Look at how amazing this is. And this is just their basic uh, data um, with it. Now, I like to keep my chart really clean. If you've seen other book maps, they have bubbles, um, a volume, things like that. I like my volume down here so I could see, hey, look, there's massive selling on the sell-off down here. Maybe that is a capitulation, something like that. Um, as you could see, we could change the colors, right? Um, essentially, it's the lowest volume. I like this, the blue to yellow, okay? And as you could see, blue is the very smallest volume count all the way up to yellow. So I, I am visually able to see support and resistance of the limit orders, right? This is just like your level two in a trading dome that shows you um, where there are limit orders above and below. We're, we're just seeing this on the visualization. Um, that's what book maps best thing is. So I know just going up here, if we start to rally up here, a, I could see there was a prior high where we failed. And look at this. The last time we were up here, there was massive volume. Now, one of the things is it only shows you the last 10 uh, ticks above and 10 ticks below. So all this is static. It's no longer moving. But as price goes up, it will refresh. And if we actually start to rally up here, and we'll see during this video, if we do rally, we will see that, hey, maybe that's only a 50 contracts now, right? Instead of the last time it was up here, probably somewhere around here, it was 99 contracts, okay? Like right here, we could see there are 70 contracts. Well, if we go lower, we will see if there's still 70, if that is a support level, because we kind of bounced off, but that number may change. But again, um, 
we won't know until price goes and that's what this bracket is and this is just kind of showing you again your level two over here is kind of a market profile of how many um where the vol most volumes traded so if you think about it if i only want to see volume for here well i could see and I could stretch this, right? I could see there were only 16 future contracts traded at these two levels. If I want to go, hey, how many contracts were traded down here? There were 54. But then I could zoom all the way out to as much time from when you start the platform, right? I could say, hey, the most volume is traded right around this uh, 3374 and a quarter level and if you think about it, that's kind of where we keep bouncing from right reversing or the most times kind of the where the most volumes traded and we could see there's been if I kind of zoom in here there's been 1443 contracts since I've turned this on at that uh 3374 and a quarter so I really really like this and this is just kind of saying hey uh, this is where the current price is now there are so many different ways to configure this if you want candlesticks right we can add candlesticks on here so if you think about it, we could get rid of maybe the buy and sell orders things like that right and only show candlesticks or we can have it we can have the best bid and offer right so it has it, everything over here if we remove the candles it just gives you a different look like i said i like to just keep this as clean as possible where was the last traded price and that's it so um heat map if you don't want the heat map okay kind of get rid of it if you want nothing and only candles you could do that and we could actually kind of get rid of all that get rid of less price if we want um and volume bars and all that so it's very very customizable um i hope uh, that kind of gives you guys a sneak peek into it shows you iceberg levels right up here um, if you uh have any positions uh your buys and uh, sells things like that over here and everything's customizable my contrast if I want to kind of make it a different color kind of change the contrast and really hey only show me the high ones or things like that I like it right around here um, you can even draw you could draw lines right support and resistance lines trend lines things like that on here and you could also clear the drawing set let's uh, clear them and they're all kind of disappeared from there um, and then we could kind of come into study configurations and there's all these different things you could change the candlesticks right hey if you want to see five minute candles we could do that right and it shows you the five minute if you want to see 30 minute candles it'll show you the 30 minute candles right if you only want to see the one minute there you go if you want zero candles uncheck that and this is where you can kind of go in and change all your settings right if i want to change this to really kind of cut off and make it all customizable hey only show me really heavy the big support levels things like that again it's all up to you it's very customizable it's um something that is very easy to use once you learn um and again i'm gonna leave a link down below in the description uh for a free trial so uh make sure you check out the uh, just click on the link uh in the uh, description um sign up for a free trial see what they have to offer and play around and use this as a uh, tutorial of how bookmap works right you could have trade large trade alerts if you want to set them up right just click here if you want the VWAP you could change colors it's very uh, customizable and then um, if you want uh, volume dots right you could have the transparency very kind of really light so you it doesn't bother you or if you want you could have them really stand out okay and you can have all the bubbles hey how much buying pressure versus selling like on this way down there's more sellers than buyers right 
Um, so you could change them to solid, gradient, however you want. Pie display, it's all up to you. So um, again, it, it just goes back to being, being very, very customizable, um, things like that. If you want to take a quick pictures, right, take a screenshot, just click that can post it to your Twitter, Facebook, if you have any of those things where you want to show everybody else what you're doing. If you want crosshairs, um, again, you pretty much have everything you need in different types of, uh, what you call it, uh, you could trade Bitcoin uh, stocks with this. Uh, so they have multiple feeds. So I would definitely click the link down below um, for your free trial. Also, just check them out through the link at uh, Bookmap, and um, I hope this video kind of helps you guys get acquainted with uh, what Bookmap has to offer, how it works, um, and just uh, how, how it could be, I believe, one of the most powerful tools uh, for your day trading, scalping, things like that. Um, like I said, I've been using it for about five years and use it almost uh, every day. I'm always glancing at it, just seeing what the overall market looks like. So, Thank you for watching this, and until next time, we'll talk to you soon. Thank you.